That's your goddamn wife. Oh, tall, black, and ugly, man. We're going, that's you, that's you, man. That's your goddamn wife. Oh, tall, black, and ugly. We're going, that's you, that's you, man. That's your goddamn wife. Oh, tall, black, and ugly. We're going, that's you, that's you, man. That's your goddamn wife. Oh, tall, black, and ugly, man. We're going, that's you, that's you, man. That's your goddamn wife. Oh, tall, black, and ugly, man. You put a goddamn wig on, that's you, that's you, man. That's your goddamn wife. Oh, tall, black, and ugly, man. Y'all heard that? Cult leader Vernon Brown. What's good, what's good, what's good, what's good? You heard that. From the cult leader of GMS. The cult, the satanic cult, that gets together on 34th and 7th every Saturday. Preaching their madness. Now, obviously, Vernon has got a problem with Negro features. Of course, you know Vernon is biracial. Oh, I don't know if y'all knew that. I don't know if the public knew that. But cult leader Vernon Brown is biracial. And obviously, he's never read 1 Samuel 16 and 7, nor does he care to listen or pay attention to or take heed to the Bible, the very word that he stands by when he preaches. The white boy Joe A. Why don't you rebuke your cult leader? Correct him. Let him know. Let him know about 1 Samuel 16 to 7. He obviously has a problem with Negro features. Black and ugly. So black is ugly to cult leader Vernon Brown. High yellow cult leader Vernon Brown. This right here is the wife of Nathaniel Seven. The leader of IUIC, Israel, Israel United in Christ. Cult leader Vernon Brown has sunk to new lows. But anyway, I mean, Deuteronomy 18, verse 22-22, cut to anyway. I mean, I don't really have to get into it. You should know by watching this channel that that's not the man to be following. This is the same fool, the same cult that told you that America would be destroyed in the year 2000. 2016 is right around the corner. Wake up. Wake up. Question of the week. Brought to you by Haitian Priest. Y'all ready? Why was Abraham allowed to marry his half-sister? Read it, Genesis 11 and 29. Explain that, cult leaders. Break it down. Because you clearly see in Leviticus 18, verse 9, Levit Leviticus 20 and 17, it's unlawful. Break that down. And uh, how many sons did Eliphaz have? That's two questions for you. And I'm out. Haitian priest signing off.